How do you know which Illuvials can be other Illuvians? Do you mean, how do I know which Illuvials can beat other Illuvials? Like, who, which Illuvial wins against which? I don't quite understand the, the question. So, basically... Oh, cheese bread. Uh, basically, by trial and error. So basically, I put this guy. I know he's uh, he's a revenant, so that's a rogue empath. Rogue means he jumps to the back. So I'm gonna put this guy versus this guy and see what happens. And then I'll try to remember for the next time. And yeah, you slowly build up your your experience by playing the game and just trying out which wins against which. And like I explained last time, all those classes right here, that's the job of the Illuvial. So I know that a Bulwark is going to be tanking. And I can put him in the front line to soak up damage. And I know that a, a Rogue is going to jump in the back line and do damage. And I know that a Scion is going to do a lot of damage. But he, if he gets attacked, he dies very fast. And now an Empath will support the team. So I know what they're supposed to do. And then I just need to position them right. Um, right now we have 25 mastery points left over, so let's try to get something nice in here. I think that's gonna do it. Actually, oh, yeah, all right. Let's see how he does versus him. I know that Vermilia, as soon as he casts, he almost kills everything. So I know that he will ca kill him as soon as his blue bar is full here and he casts his Omega, but... As you see there, the enemy guy was getting some free mana because he was getting damage. So he was casting a heal. Look at that. That's so much damage. So I know he's going to win, win in the long run. But in the short term, he's going to help him cast the enemy's heal a bit faster. So it's not the best idea to do that. <laughs> 